today we are going to talk about six books that you cannot read. Not that you don't know how or that you physically can't. Maybe the better word is shouldn't. I don't know if you're like me. I am a rebel and I read what I shouldn't all the time. It's just what I do. It's part of what makes me me. Let's start off with one of the, I don't know, easier ones. Well, I say easier. Um, I had to take away the cover because I don't even know if that's allowed on YouTube. And this one actually got banned on Amazon. You can find the paperback and the ebook on my website and edenbooks.org. <sighs> what can I say about this book? Let's just say that it's age gap. It's super taboo. Um, there's actually two stories in there and it kicks off my taboo treat series, which is a bunch of interconnected standalones. Um, but yeah, this one got me in trouble, but it's a really good book. It's super spicy. Definitely recommend this one and the cover. If you want to see it, you're going to have to go to my website. I'll leave the link down below so you can go check it out. Um, the cover's spicy too, but the inside is super spicy. What's next? This is for baby. Okay, this is one of my favorite books that I've written. And it's just, it's dark, it's thrilling, it's intense. There's like psychological elements. It's just so good. And the villain is so bad. Anyway, this one got banned too. <laughs> but it's still not banned on some of the other platforms, just on Amazon. So you can grab it up at like, I think Apple and Barnes and Noble and Kobo and some other places um, for free. And of course you can also get it on my website for free, the ebook, and then the paperback you can get on my website too. And Amazon might've kept the paperback. I don't know. Sometimes I don't understand them, but the good guys always win, right? Not this time. What's next? Cognati. I actually have a pen name called Elizabeth Gray, and this is what I use for my like thrillers and psychological, you know, fiction type stuff that's like dark and everything. Anyway, this is such a dark story and you know, it's not categorized as romance, but there is romance in it and there is steam in it. So for those people who like that kind of thing, it's definitely in there. But for those people who are like, I want something that's just going to totally just mess with my brain. Cognati is the book for you. This one's actually in Kindle Unlimited. They Maybe because I categorized it not as romance, it's not, you know, ban worthy, but the stuff in it is questionable and <laughs> you will know when you read this and, and you'll get to some parts and be like, that sweet little blonde girl wrote this, like what? So one that I am like most notoriously known for is The Wild. The Wild got banned and caused like a whole like social media phenomenon and you can actually go to one of my videos where I talked about this in um, depth but the wild is so good it is just so good and it's a survival romance and it's taboo forbidden um, age gap just all of these yummy yummy things that you can't get on Amazon apparently so um, you can get it on my website ebook or your Kindle you just can't buy it from Amazon and of course the paperback, the formatting is just stunning. Anytime people order from my website, I sign these, I personalize them if you like them that way. And then I give you like tons of swag. Like I'm an, I'm the swag queen. Like I will hook you up with stickers and pens and just all kinds of fun stuff. So you really shouldn't read it, but we do what we want. So hail is another one that I couldn't even put on Amazon because I knew they were going to ban it. Like that. So I didn't even try. It just went straight to my website and edenbooks.org. If you like flowers in the attic, but wanted something like super romantic and angsty and just emotional, then Hail is the book for you. And of course, I like my books to have happily ever afters. And a lot of times with taboo and forbidden books, they don't have the happily ever afters. I make it happen. So. Again, you have to get this one, you know, out of the trunk of my car. No, not really. Um, but for real, it, you, you can't just buy this anywhere. It's so intense and just, I mean, you are gonna, your face is gonna turn red when you're reading parts of it and you're gonna be like, why am I reading this? Why am I, 
enjoying this. Like, why? This is so weird, Christy. But trust me, I will give you a good story and you will be thoroughly entertained and you will be happy with the ending. And finally, this last one is called Love Trips. I can't even tell you what it's about without probably YouTube like shutting me down or something. It's got three triplets as the main characters. It's just a little shorty. You can tell it's just a little short book. Um, you can buy it individually on my website, but the ebook is actually free on my website. So if you don't know this about me, you can go to my website and click on the books and then drop on down. And there is a spot called free books. And then when you open it up, there's like so many things to choose from. And I have a lot of these like little baby books. Um, there's even one that is coming in the mail and hopefully I'll do a video about that one soon too, because I get a lot of grief from that one. Uh, it's called Laska. So you can check out all those free books or you can get the paperbacks if you like, you know, hard copies of things. And typically people don't do a hard, uh, you know, a physical copy of like a short story. And I used to not either, but then I decided, you know what? I like these little books. Like I think they're cute and I think they're little like collectors things, you know? So I just started making these for all my short stories and including them on my, you know, website. These are books that you should not read. Um, I say you can't read, not very easily. You have to kind of dig to get these books. Cognati is only hidden because it's under a pen name. So I think that's why it hasn't like gotten in trouble, but it, it's got, it's not any worse than or better than these books. And these ones did get in trouble or were too bad. They, they weren't allowed. Anyway, um, if you don't know me, I'm Kay Webster and I am the queen of all things taboo. I get my books banned sometimes and a lot of times my books just are too bad to even get on there. These types of books are what, you know, people know me for. So anyway, I hope you enjoyed this video and I am going to try to come up with some other suggestions for you guys to read um, when you're looking for something different and you know, you don't know what else to read and stuff like this is totally, totally, totally going to make you happy. That's all for now guys.